Eagles and in Mag Sites. Black Vikings back. I'm ready to react. Now, um, I'm going to do this reaction video to the Hot Crazy Matrix. I actually saw a little bit of this before, but never did a reaction on it. It's been so long since I've seen it, I want to actually watch it again. And I'll give you my input on uh, what the man is saying, all right? So let's get this going. So I remember him saying some real shit. Like while it was comical, hey, buddy, James he was saying sponsor. some real I got stuff. Paris mouthpiece with me. <laughs> this is a uh, uh, go introduce yourself. I'm Dana McClendon. I am the consulary to the Camden Mafia <laughs> and the terrorist mouthpiece. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, what are we going to talk about? What are you going to talk about today? Today's lesson is it's a little off the beaten path, the tactical response, but it's still something that you can use every day. This is the hot crazy matrix. It's what you need to know about how to deal with women and, and, and how to analyze the situation that you may be in or want to be in. Okay, uh, let's take a look at that right now. Okay, so this is the universal hot crazy matrix. It's everything a young man needs to know about women. Um, I've developed this on my own over 46 years of living on the earth. So <laughs> this is how it works. You have your crazy axis and your hot axis. Hot is, as usual, measured from 0 to 10. We're all familiar with that. Okay. Crazy is measured from 4 to 10 because, of course, there's no such thing as a woman who's not at least 4 crazy. <laughs> so you've got 4 to 10. This is your hot crazy line right here. Very important that you keep in mind where the hot crazy line is. Okay. As a rule, this is your no-go zone. We do not hang around and date and marry women who are not, at least in our mind, a five. Um, so this That's is your no-go zone. That's you don't true. go here. We That's just rule this out. Life is better this way. That's the way it is. All right? Exactly. Um, Absolutely. Above a five and to about an eight. Mm -hmm. And below the crazy line, this is your fun zone. You can hang out here and 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 uh, meet these girls and spend time with them. That's your fun zone. But keep in mind, when you're in the fun zone, you want to move out of the fun zone to a more permanent location. Okay. Um, so that's the fun zone above a five, hot. Below an eight, hot. And below the crazy line. This means these are most of the time not crazy. Mm -hmm. Okay. Above the danger zone, above the uh, above the crazy line, we have the danger zone. This is your redheads, your strippers, anyone named Tiffany. Um, this is hairdressers. This is where this is where your car gets keyed. You get a bunny in the pot. Uh, your tires get slashed, and you wind up in jail. Um, now, now that we have some of the chart filled in. We got a couple more pieces to put in, but at this point. Understand something. This is not a static environment. This is a situation where you have got to uh, use this matrix over time to develop some reliable data. It's like a dope chart, okay? You uh, because at any moment in time, any woman that you have previously located on this chart mm -hmm. can vanish from that location and appear anywhere else on the chart. So That's what you true. have to do is over time collect some data. And once you have a cluster of data points, you can begin to consider that reliable. Now, moving on, you have this zone here. This is below the crazy line, above an eight hot, but still, you know, about a seven crazy. This is your date zone. You can stay in the date zone indefinitely. These are women that you introduce to your friends and your family. Um, they're, they're good looking and they're reasonably not crazy most of the time. Okay? <laughs> so this is, you can stay here indefinitely. Now, above an eight hot and between about a seven and a five crazy, this is your wife zone. Okay? When you meet this girl, you should consider a long term relationship. Uh, this zone is not scaled to size. 
this this is a this is a representation and not an actual if this is not a pie chart showing you how many of these yeah, people are out small. there this is simply a, a representation of what you're after you want to be five to seven crazy above an eight high that's your wife's zone okay, okay. now below a five crazy and above an eight high don't exist this is your unicorn zone <laughs> <laughs> if you find a unicorn please capture it yes. safely keep it alive yes we'd like to study it and maybe look at how to replicate that okay? exactly so i was explaining this to a guy one time and he said wait a minute I met this girl and she's like smoking hot. She's like at least a nine and she's chill. She's co totally cool. She's like not even a three crazy. I said, you're telling me you've met a girl, she's a nine hot and she's like a two or a three crazy. He said, yeah, man, I like her a lot. I said, you should be careful. That's a dude, you're talking to a tranny. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> so, you, you gotta be careful because down here, below a four crazy, and above an eight hot, he's probably talking to a dude. <laughs> that is the universal hot crazy matrix. All right, man, that's pretty good. Now, let me ask you, like, for the, for the women watching, is, th is there a male version of that? I mean, oh, yeah. would it also be... Oh, yeah, it's a little it, simpler. If a dude is super hot, okay. Yeah, it's a little simpler, but we can do it real quick. It doesn't hmm. take very long at all. Okay. For women, this is your, this is your matrix. You got your cute axis, and you got your money access. Okay? And <laughs> there's um, no crazy. You have there's only three sections. Women have a very large no-go zone. <laughs> this is for dudes who are neither hot nor have a lot of money. Um, you'll notice over here this is the husband section. Uh, once you cross a line and have sufficient amounts of money, it is no longer relevant how hot you are. Exactly. And then women have a fun zone here where a dude is broke but hot. <laughs> <laughs> Real simple. There you go. Uh, <laughs> remember, your responsibility to be ready to date hot bitches never ends. Absolutely love this. Here <laughs> ended the lesson. Hey, Al. So, I tell you this. I've definitely dealt with. A girl that was between the eight and ten mark is hot, and was an absolute fucking eight or nine with the crazy. As a matter of fact, it was the one that I talked about in the worst coochie I've ever had video. I'll post that link below. I've dealt with some of these women. I don't think that I've seen the unicorn. Um, I met this one girl I know, and she seemed she's really good. You know she's. She, 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 she's hot, and but it, the crazy came out later, and I knew, I knew, I, I was waiting for the other shoe to drop, bro. I was just like, I knew she was fucking crazy. So, more of the story is, man, you're going to have to learn to deal with crazy, no matter what, when you deal with a woman, because women are crazy. I can I I don't think I can think of a woman that I messed with that wasn't crazy. Well, maybe one, maybe one, and she was she was real hot. She was between that eight, and, but she was uh, I don't know. She she had her issues, but she wasn't like crazy. Like I've dealt with crazy before. Trust me. <laughs> so post your comments below. Let me know what you think of this. I know it's an older video, but I had my fun watching it. I'd never seen the complete video before, so you did get my real to life reaction. Alright. One million subscribers. Woo!